Hey everybody, it's Chugga Conroy! Welcome back to more Animal Crossing New Leaf! Last time, we celebrated Shari's birthday and had a grand old awkward time! W w what else would you expect from the Grey Monkey herself? Anyway, today, on this dark and stormy night, which is what you'd expect to be during Shari's birthday, really, it is actually Pietro's birthday! Yeah, the brightest, shiniest ray of sunshine in our town has his birthday on a dark, stormy day like today, yeah. Anyway, from Timothy Nook, <laughs> I ordered Pietro a present the other day, and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna wrap that. I'll keep it a little bit of a secret from you guys. I like that little detail, how, like, when the store is smaller and you order items, it's, like, from Timmy, you know, then it's from, like, Timmy Nook, then it's, like, Timothy Nook. It's, like, they get, like, classier and classier as they go along. Anyway, I don't want to waste any more time, so let's head on over to Pietro's. We haven't seen him in a while. At least I don't think we have. It'd be kind of funny if we spent time with him on Shari's birthday. In fact, I think we kind of did. Wow, I'm, I'm just great. Anyway, Pietro! Let's see. Pietro and Chester are best friends! I can kind of see that. I was waiting for you, Shorty. I knew you'd come to see me. Anyway, come on in and let's enjoy the party together. Crazy! He says. Aw, oh, Pietro. His carpet and wallpaper are kind of weird for what he is. What does Chester have to say? So you came to celebrate Pietro's birthday too, huh? I'm so glad now that you're here. It really feels like a party, rookie. You know, it's kind of auto Pietro, like, hasn't been in any parties except, um... It's kind of auto Pietro hasn't been in any parties except for, well, mine, though, because you'd expect him to come to parties, like, all the time. I mean, you'd figure him to be the one to make the balloon animals and all that stuff, though, but of course, no, he doesn't do that. Anyway, Chester gave me a present a little bit, but my heart's been beating really fast and said, oh, does someone have a little bit of a crush? Huh? Those eyes? By any chance, do you have a present for me? I could never say I forgot. That is such a mean thing to say. They make you feel horrible if you legitimately didn't, don't have a gift for them. Anyway, yes. I got you this. Are you sure it's for me? Well, if that's the case, I won't hesitate to open it up. Congratulations, you just got a new scarf! Even though it looks like a shirt. I swear, it's a scarf! I didn't expect you to buy me a gift this perfect. I even thought about getting this exact gift for myself, I'm, so I'm really happy. Thanks a lot, Shorty. Thanks, Shorty. This is the first time someone has been so very kind to me. There he goes! Isn't it nice and colorful and, you know, just really, really happy looking like he is? I mean, just look at it. I feel like we could be much more than friends. Oh. We could be best friends! <laughs> oh, I like that. I like that a lot. That is really, really cool. So yeah, Pietro looks really nice in his scarf, or rather his shirt that he's wearing as a scarf. Now, what he was saying is I didn't think you'd get me a gift this perfect. Like I said, there are usually two categories of items that animals like. Um, I believe that Pietro, it's flashy and colorful. And the thing is, is that this item is both flashy and colorful the way that it's classified, so that's why Pietro liked it so much. Anyway, I want to talk to him one more time. A relationship where the bond of friendship just forms so tightly. Describes us pretty well, don't you think? Crazy? Yeah, I think so too. Anyway, that's pretty much it. We gave him a present, he had a really, really good time. His day's almost done, I think we'll leave him to go to sleep. Thanks a lot for coming. Oh, and thank you for the present. I'll, I'll be sure to never forget this great day. Aww. I don't know why, just Pietro... You know what? I get it. I know why Pietro and Chester are the best of friends. Not only do they live next to each other, but Pietro is the balloon... The guy who makes the balloons for the party, and Chester's got the cake covered. That, that's gotta be it. Is that the two of them just have to throw parties in their spare time, and they just compliment one another so well in doing so. Anyway, though. Uh, those are the main festivities going on today, so I think we should get into what have we missed since last time, because believe it or not, something actually pretty big happened here in Pallet since we last met up. And if we head up to Main Street, we can see what that is. Dun, da, 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 Yes, traditionally in Animal Crossing games, there are four levels to the Nook store, but here, the Nooklings go one step above and beyond. When you have had TIY, you can have Gracie visit your town, as I've gone over before, and once you have passed Gracie's fashion check four times, Gracie and the Nooklings will team up to create this superstore. Unfortunately, as you might have noticed, even though it's got some flowers from the guy, Leaf's gardening store is no more. It's not here anymore. And I didn't really get a chance to show you guys Leaf saying goodbye, but he just kind of wanted everyone to know that his store had a good run and he really, really enjoyed running it, but time has come for it to close up shop. Anyway, let's go inside this new store. Nah, just kidding, faked you guys out. Yeah, he is now actually a part of the Nookling store, so he has a much nicer roof over his head. Anyway, let's talk to him. Ah, hey, hey, if it isn't Emil. 
the shop. It's lovely, right? And it's so packed with happy products. Timmy and Tommy said they were expanding the shop, so I had to make a happy little space for me. We've got a lot more floor space for new items, so come by often to see what, what sort of happy things I'll have. Okay, so he has quite a few things. Uh, first off, you can have one uh, plant furniture item for you each day. He's gonna sell you two flowers each day, two bushes, a sapling, and down here we got some new stuff. We got two tools over here, of course. I'll sell you the axe and the watering can each day, though. But this right here is a bamboo shoot. This can be a few different things. The bamboo shoot is a special type of plant that I want to go over another time. I will purchase this one, though. Just to kind of, so I can have that planted and I can show it to you next time we meet up. Now, in addition to that, he will also sell you fertilizer. This will increase your chances of getting hybrid flowers and having, you know, plants that don't always grow, that kind of stuff, succeed if you plant it adjacent, if you place it in the ground adjacent to whatever plant you have just planted. There is a reward for buying 50 fertilizers, just like there is for buying a lot of flowers, just like there is for buying a lot of anything in this store. So, you definitely want to buy this every chance you get, should you be trying to get all of the, should you be trying to get everything, okay? Should you be trying to go for stuff like that and that kind of thing. Oh, let's see. Uh, oh, Shari. Blank stare. Crazy meeting you here, cheeky. So anyway, did you need something? What's the latest? This department store has three levels, right? That's ginormous, cheeky. Yeah, you bet it's ginormous. Anyway, so I need to go over the kinds of things you can get here. You get a song stationery. Two stationaries a day. Of course, you can buy as many as you want. Wrapping papers, you can buy as many as you want per day. Uh, one medicine, still two fortune cookies, and you get three tools. But you get two KK songs per day at random. Yeah, two KK songs per day. TNT Emporium is OP. Please nerf. Am I right? <laughs> I am so lame talking like it's an MMO mechanic when it's a store in Animal Crossing. But yeah. You got two KK songs every day, which is awesome. But if you go up to the second floor, we're gonna go. We just saw Timothy. We're gonna go see Timothy now, or Tommy, I guess. I think Timothy sounds kind of awkward. Okay. On the second floor, you will get two wall hanging items each day. You will get two carpets, two wallpapers, and five pieces of ground furniture. So you have quite the selection. But the true awesomeness lays in the third floor. Check it out. If it isn't you, aren't you a cypher sore eyes? Thanks to you, I've decided to open my boutique here in town. You've got style, but you're not a fashionista yet. Consider my shop to be your new classroom. Now then, you simply must feast your eyes on these trendy designs courtesy of yours truly. Okay, so Gracie will sell you different items from, you know, all kinds of things. She will sell you shirts, she will sell you bottoms, she will sell you dresses, and, you know, she has a lot of items you can only get through her. These shoes, for example, are really, really nice-looking shoes. You can only get them here. You have accessories and all that. You have these mannequins just kind of showing you different things. But, as I'm sure you've noticed, she has furniture items, such as the princess sofa. There are furniture sets you can only get from Gracie, and they are absurdly expensive. In fact, I think I went over this before, though, but I'll just show you. Technically, it's priced, but if I had to put a rest of it, does 100,000 bells sound fair? That's quite a price, Gracie. I can see the idea of impeccable style tastes a bit outside your comfort zone, hun. Gee, thanks. But yeah, these are those furniture sets. There are They change every single season. This current one is Princess, though, but throughout the other seasons of the year, I'll show on screen which ones you can get. Anyway, though, pretty much does it. I suppose now is just as good a time as ever to mention a nice little factoid about Gracie. And that is the fact that you might notice that her, um, her speech bubble is green which is typically representatory of male characters, but she's a female voice. In other Animal Crossing games, Gracie had a male voice, and the reason for that is, in the Japanese versions of Animal Crossing games, Gracie is actually a super flamboyant man and was edited to be female outside of Japan. I know, it's kind of odd, and it's kind of strange that they did that, because I don't think there's anything wrong with you having, like, a flamboyant male character that's just really into fashion. I mean, heck, my mother taught me all about fashion when I was a kid. I am just digging myself a hole here. Anyway. Uh, that does it for all the stuff that you can get here and just kind of going over the basics. You bet I want to complete that princess set one day, but this KK song here, I didn't go over this before. It is called Two Days Ago, and traditionally Two Days Ago was a secret KK song you could only get by requesting it from KK himself. That is not the case here, however, as those songs will not appear for sale in the Nookling store, and this one has. So, if that's no longer a secret KK song, what about the other songs I Love You in KK Song? Those aren't secrets now either. So if that's the case, what is? Well, 
I'm not sure if you noticed, but it is nighttime on a Saturday. How about we go and ask KK himself? See what he did there? Okay, so we've gone over a special KK song before that you can only get sometimes. You, you back, Mac. You must be digging the cheers that I'm bringing to your ears. So, you here for a song? Oh, you know it. Cool. I'm taking the quest if you got an itch for an old favorite. You can belt out the name of a song or just tell me how you're feeling. It's all cool with me. Oh. Alright, I'll, 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 I'll be good for this one. Okay. So, name your lick and I'll belt it out, Sir Groovitude. So, I went over a special KK song already. KK Birthday. And that song he will only play for you on the Saturday before your birthday, or on your birthday if it is a Saturday. So, I already got KK Birthday, but what happens if I try to request it on a normal old Saturday? I only pull that one out on special occasions, you dig. I can take another request, though, if you're still feeling it. I'm down like a clown. Hey, how fitting on Pietra's birthday. Awesome. So, in addition to KK Birthday, there are songs that you can only get from KK by requesting them. You must type them in exactly right, or else he will not play them. He will never play these songs at random, and you cannot get them from the Nookling store. They are as follows. KK Stroll. KK Island. And Hypno KK. We just got done playing a Pokemon game around here, so what do you know? Let's do Hypno KK. Let's see how this sounds. Is it gonna be like, tr like you know, trans techno? Oh, who hipped you to that tune, June? Who hipped me to it? Hypno! <laughs> Hypno KK is a secret song. I see you no square, so I'll play you fair. Pull up a chair. Oh, he has got so much flair. Enough tuning. Let's groove. This next one's for you, Emil. It's called Hypno KK. Cool, man. Cool. Check your pockets. I slipped you a boot of the song. That didn't sound anything like I expected. Not that that's a bad thing, mind you. I liked the sound of it a lot. And even though I was going to turn around and talk to Dr. Trunk, let's just walk out on him. Yeah, story of his life. Okay. So, we celebrated Pietro's birthday with him. We got to see the new Nookling store. And we got ourselves a new KK song. And I went over the secret KK songs. I'd say we made quite a bit of progress here. So, let's go ahead and head home. Um, I liked it better when KK was playing it. That is creepy. Best part is that Shari was actually the one who told me to request that song from KK, which is why I did it. Alright, well, 
I think I'm going to go and have my nightmares now. I am going to just turn up the lights and go to bed. Okay, okay, not quite yet. All right, so what are we going to miss? Well, absolutely nothing, and that is because our next meeting is tomorrow. It is Easter Sunday. So, tomorrow on Animal Crossing New Leaf, we'll be celebrating Easter together and meeting up for two consecutive days, I believe, for the first time since I started doing these holiday updates. See you guys then.